Good evening, everyone. It is a cold January morning. Yeah. Morning? Evening. It's morning somewhere <laughs> in the world. First sentence, and it's already gone to pot. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Welcome once again to the Athena Games. Uh, I'm Elliot Baker, one of your best, get your best, your well, one of the best commentators around, but a guest commentator for tonight. And alongside me, we have special guest uh, commentators, Wojtek and Stephen Sage. Hello. Howdy. <laughs> We have quite the uh, interesting match tonight, matchup tonight, haven't we? We have uh, Owen versus Sean. Um, it's only a matter of time until we find out how long those lances remain on the board. <laughs> well, someone had to say it, as you yeah. say. Yeah. <laughs> um, we have, of course, but the first time we've seen the sheath appeared on stream, so that's going to be a new experience for me. No sheath appeared on Saturday's tournament. We didn't nice. see anything. At all. Not since. They are very popular all around the world, and mm -hmm. people are flying them on small and large tournaments, and we have seen several of them on on uh, all of the regionals that were streamed this weekend. There was like four or four of them at least, and there was loads of shitty beats, mostly Fenro, the one that we see here. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I'm not surprised people will start using them here as well. Right, I'm going to go and let our competitors know that they may begin. Cool. A lot of people on Vassal playing around with Fenro okay. as well. Um, Fenro, from what I've come across, Fenro... Low rick, something else. Okay. It's, it's what pay, a lot of people So you're going to have to pay 20 something for a fan, 30 something, so you will have 45, almost 50 points. Yeah. So you can fit Poe, you can fit like economic Cheap Miranda Ray. as well. Cheap Miranda, yeah. Ray? Ray? Probably not Ray. Not Ray. Not Ray. Like, you could put Chewy probably, I think. Yes, you can. My Angry Birds Chewy is 45. Okay, that's enough. That's yeah. enough to fit with alongside Fan yeah. and Low rick. With some basic loadout as well. So, what do you think gonna happen here? Now we were discussing the the list that Owen's using, which is the, mm -hmm. the Ghost, Kanan, and Zeb. Crack um, special, Crack off special. Uh, did very well. A version of this did very well at uh, Crack off regionals. Mm -hmm. um, you look at this list and you you wonder how it works. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> so you did. You just think. That shouldn't be Owen's taking a competitive list. list. So one of the guys who was flying in Krakow like, wrote a long post on, on Facebook explaining why Sync Turret instead of TLT. And he basically said there are several, several advantages. First of all, you can boost into range 1 when you don't have your donut hole. Yeah. Your range 3 is the, best, is the worst one, comparing to TLT. So you boost into range 1, you boost at PS11, and then you roll five dice, primary shot, and then three dice for sync turret. And if you have your opponent in dark, both of those shots can be fully modded. Yes, that's and that's massive. And that's that is potentially a monster. so that's that's not like um, that's not like constant and better attrition game with TLT, but that's a better burst damage yeah. compared mm -hmm. to the TLT version. Sean keeping the asteroids very much in the corner at two two from each corner. Mm -hmm. Same for Owen, I just placing there. They mm -hmm. definitely want to keep <coughs> the board open with their. Uh, large ships involved, although yeah. I think Owen has the advantage because he has a small base ship as well, but uh, I don't know. I think it's going to be in Sean's favor. Sean's got the firepower involved, but and again, don't discount that ghost. No. And the, the ghost has its evade, which will slow it down, but I imagine Owen's going to slow roll he the first couple of games, first right. couple of rounds, so that he can bank up the focus you reckon on he's gonna be evading with Kanan Jers or he's gonna be focusing every every oh, time on possible Kanan. because he's got so, reconspect yeah. so mm. that will give me two focuses which yeah. is potentially almost like two evades yeah hello Blando78 and hello Lord of Britannia and is, so, is what's EPT on Asajj Ventures Predator a Predator Predator so both of the Lancers have really nice offensive modifications yeah. if they will be taking focus you can expect them to be getting two, three, four hits every turn. Almost a full mod reel roll on both of them. Yeah. And uh, that's that's even before you count that ketsu has got expert handling. You yeah. can barrel mm -hmm. all over the mm -hmm. place. And shed target locks, which I think is also important. Yeah. I think he has built this list to counter ordinance. Mm -hmm. Owen has one. <coughs> but he has Sync's turret, which is going to be a pain with, Ke with Ketsu. Lando is Scott Free Falcon, apparently, going to this. <laughs> ah, how you doing, Scott? You alright? <laughs> um, I think, in, in, indirectly, the expert handling is going to be a bit of a problem for Owen, because mm. the sync turret relies on that target lock. Yeah. And um, since Kanan will move and apply that target lock before Ketsu moves, so if the opportunity to shed that target lock before yeah. the attack comes in, mm -hmm. Owen's got to watch out for that. Mm-hmm. 
and if he's flying Ketsu properly, stress isn't a major thing for him because he's going to be going fast. He's going to be doing his three turns mm. and, mm-hmm. and he's going to be shaking that block. Kanan, so Kanan Jarus with Lorik or Bix was always a big problem for Twin Twin Shadows. And I wonder how switching for Sync Turret is going to change it. Mm. Is it going to make it easier or worse? And my second big big question is, Fen Rao here. If... If Sean can kill Fen Rao quickly, he will win this game. Mm. The longer Fen Rao lives, the better for, for the ghost. The more actions he will take, the more he will be able to arc dodge those those yeah. answers. He has to he also has to remember Fen Rao has a rear arc. Yes. Which on multiple multiple Magic. times I've played against Fen Rao, mm-hmm. I've forgotten about the rear arc. Mm-hmm. It's but, easy to forget, isn't it? Yeah. It's just it's a tidy chip. You don't expect it to have one. And it can strip up, well, it stops you spending your tokens. Does Fenrir's ability work in either arc? Yes. Yeah. Okay, that's good. So, so if Sean would like to counter this Fenrir, he should be taking evades every yeah. time. Because he's got a fair amount of glitter stims. He's got rerolls from Predator and Dengar. So if he's just taking evade, he can pretty much ignore Hotshot Copilot mm. on Fenrir. Yeah. yeah, that will ignore that part. And that will also ignore his pilot ability. Yeah, ability. because you can spend you can spend a beta, but you just can't mm-hmm. spend focus yep. tokens yep. or target locks. Yeah. Yeah. But of course, Glitzim is not spending a focus token. Mm-hmm. No. So, if anything, this is kind of... Sean's got the kryptonite to Owen Superman list. Yeah. Although, you know, it's it's always nice to <coughs> run in range 1 from a ghost, take focus target lock or just re- Dengar rerolls and take a focus and just pump 4, four damage into him. Yeah. And th- that... You cannot do with Fenrau. You just have to. You just have to hope for. For some luck with dice. Ah, cheers, Blando. We appreciate that. We like to kind of make sure that uh, uh, our stream quality is quite high. High. I mean, the other thing we have a problem with is the camera, but that's about it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so one thing I really wish we could get a more a higher quality camera. The camera's very good. It's just hmm. the, the distance between here and the stage yeah. is quite. Seeing, fast. The, seeing the dice can be a blur. And that, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah. And we're off. Here we go. The ghost is beginning its slow jaunt mm-hmm. towards the opposite side of the board. There is a lot of space there, isn't there? Yeah. He can, from pretty much, spec. he can pretty much just go one forward mm-hmm. each time. Happy New Year, Can Kissing. And you probably can't see those focus tokens as clearly as they deserve, but they <laughs> are little A-wings, which I believe he got them from Cogger 2? Yes. Cogger 2, yep. custom made. They're mirror, custom made. They're mirror sheen... <laughs> Uh, focus tokens yeah. uh, for um, which in the shape of A wings, mm. uh, because of course the 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 eyeball is the cockpit. Yeah, you know. <laughs> I think he's also had some Falcon ones. Made yeah, up for he's got Falcon for evades. I've got my mitts on one of those because you only ever need one for your Falcon. <laughs> Fair <laughs> enough. Yep. <laughs> I don't need a pile of those. But uh, PJ's brought up an interesting question: Han Solo crew with sync turret. Oh, so yeah. that you can spend target lock to turn all focuses. Lock. Yeah. Ooh. But you will have to take your rerolls first and then spend yeah. the target lock. Which you really want. Which is fine. Yeah. Which is okay. The only downside is, of course, you have to acquire that target lock each round. Yeah. Well, you would put it on Kane and Jarvis with fire control system, so... That's, yeah, you, you put it with something with fire yeah. control. Yeah. This is not a terrible but choice. But, like PJ said, recon spec is your better choice. With yeah. You could but, have recon spec and Han Solo, though. Yep. Oh, God. Uh, yeah. yeah, there you go. And Don't just keep spend. recons as yeah. your evades because of Kanan's ability. Yeah, essentially. Uh, this is going to be... I don't see this going... Focus token banked on Ray. Yeah, yeah, there we go. you got to keep... And that's it. Yeah. I'm surprised he didn't like start to run away with the ghost, seeing them on the on like, on like the diagonal mm-hmm. corner. So he could have just like turned left straight away. I think Sean's going to flank him. Yeah, it's looking like that. Uh, the lower... Uh, Maybe as, even with both. I'm going to find out which one is which. No, yeah. Maybe even with both. Yeah, we can see which one is moving first and then... I need, I need to stop doing hand movements for the board because... It's, 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 not, it's, it's not helping it's for not the people helping who are watching this. <laughs> but I maybe mean, swinging round to the right with the top one and swinging around the back you, with the bottom You would need like a pen tool. Special yes. tool, so you can like draw on the board and like draw maneuvers and stuff. Yeah. That would be cool. But I think kill this when you're in arc free with sync turret, spend hand focuses to hit. Yeah. Yep, yep. That's the combo. So red is a sash. Red is a sash. Yeah, we will see her moving first. 
in just a moment. So I'll mark her up. So I don't know if you have noticed, but Sean already started taking focus with his with his lancers. Oh dear, <laughs> that means yeah, that means. Which is maybe he will just start evading at some point. Mm -hmm. But I think focus is a waste when you if, have yeah, shot combined. It could be trying to lull, uh, lull Owen into false sense of security. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah. part of the game is psychological, but oh, yes. but it we could just see. see that he's not. Maybe he's not realized. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, he will realize after the first turn. Yeah, he because will. If you know you will have to spend your focus on defense, you better take evade because it's just better. He's going for the joust. Very aggressive. Okay. Okay. I mean, it's not the TLT ghost again. So yeah. Staying at long range is better for him because Sink Tower is to one be... to two, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. One to two. Still, yeah. don't underestimate that four dice primary. No, mm -hmm. no. <laughs> you ever get a chance to use that four dice primary, take it. It's yeah. very effective. So, one thing I, uh, I saw on one of the reasons was uh, the ghost having tactical jammer. Mm -hmm. Oh, but no engine upgrade on this no. one. Fine, yes. fine. That would be either or. Cool. Which obviously helps. Fenrir Keep to survive. Fenrir like, ah, very aggressive. Yeah, very nice. aggressive. He's going in. Well, if he can shadow caster title Fenrir. So you may you also can... notice on Sean's casters, he's got custom turrets. Yep. Asarge is currently pointing forwards. I think. I'm pretty sure it's forwards. Asarge is actually so pointing. So Asarge yeah, is to the right. Yeah. Asarge right. is to the uh, right. And Ketsu, Ketsu is forward. forward. Ketsu is forward. Hmm. So I'm there surprised. are no barrel rolls on Fenrau, right? On the new shuttle, the old shuttle had the barrel roll. Yeah. I mean, He's yeah. got vector thrusters on Fenrau. Oh, yeah. So he can barrel natively if he yeah. wants to. Is it range 2 from, from the Shadowcaster? From, from uh, for, Ketsu? The title. If it's not range 2, then uh, he doesn't have to be afraid of this yeah. shit. It's but if it is, two, yeah. and she can pull, her, pull, her, pull him... Is he so, coordinated? So Fenrau just moved, moved and he coordinated all. Like yeah. He yeah, declared it. Coordinated, yeah. He's now thinking, what should he do? Yeah, yeah, Fenner's, hot, yeah. Fenner's hot shot. There is now coordinating to get a, an evade on There's the ghost. There's that Falcon evade. Yeah. There's the Falcon. <laughs> Your own mini fleet yeah. right there, ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> is he going to take another focus from Ray? He could do. I think it'd be... Should he then? That's the question. Yeah. Because you don't want to take... If you, well, dip many, if you dip you into that them, pile you, too much, yeah. You waste them, yeah. If he's expecting Sean to be shooting at Fenrau, which I think Sean should be shooting at Fenrau now, yeah. uh, he shouldn't be taking more focuses yeah. because he just needs to... Well, he can only... Yeah. One of them an can Has he put evade tokens down? I think, I that think there are has, evade tokens. Yeah. First the shot, Fenrau range two into uh, Ketsuonia. Oh, it's actually I close. Think it's it's three actually. Could be three. So there will be yeah. no tar truck three. Range yep. band three. Yep. Cool. Two dice. So Fenrau first. Fenrau first. That looks like just a hit to me. Fireball or a hit? It yes. should be fine. You're always he better. <laughs> He's not even. <laughs> Nothing there. Nothing. <laughs> All eyeball. So see, <coughs> if he would be focused now, he would have to spend that focus, and yeah. that would be yeah. such a waste. Yeah. Um, interesting point from Scott there. Uh, if he could have ranged one boosted with that coordinate action. He could have. Should, should he though? But that's, then he's ranged one of all his enemy ships. Yeah, uh, he's not got a target lock on yet, has he? So, yeah. ah, but so he'd have the range one attack. So yeah, but then have the range get the fire control, the control system and then have the sync turret shot. Good point. So now Ketsu is shooting at the ghost because Fenrau was not in range for the title. Oh dear. Ray is going on. Ray is going on, yeah. yeah. So Ketsu oh, no, removing no. one oh, no, no, he's, first. No, he's so not too fair enough. Oh, no, no, he's spending it. He did. Yeah. Oh, he's spending he's it. He's doing a Kanan's yeah. ability. Yep. All of a sudden, that does make the Shadowcaster... Two hits, two, though. Yeah. Two yeah. hits. Don't knock it. I mean, it's one less, but still, yeah. that's still a full spread. Yeah. And that's two hits that the fact. So one, taking one. One shield. Yeah, that's just one shield. For a, that's not too bad for a, a first volley actually from the yeah. Shadowcaster. Mm -hmm. um, he spent two tokens to get the. the yeah, it is. He is spending his tokens quite mm -hmm. freely, but I guess they're there to be spent. Yeah. And then it's going to be think so. no out of range. Is out of range. Oh, 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 that's oh. close. <coughs> Do the nubs count? Do the nubs count? <laughs> that is out. Okay, okay then. Not for the range. So a ton of dice being chucked now. He's 
four dice into <coughs> Ketsu with his focus. That's eyeball, four eyeball, hits. eyeball hit. Yeah. Spend the focus. Spend, spend the that focus. focus. Yeah, that's, yep. yeah. Spend that. Yep. That's four hits into Ketsu. Not terribly bad. Not at all. And he hasn't popped stem. Mm. Mm. So he's gonna. He, he's he's going taking. He's, he's gonna feel it. And he's using his fire control system straight away. Now maneuver. Does he, yeah. Does he have fancy target locks? We will see. We will see. I'm going to be very disappointed. He oh, he's got the crow ones. He's the creator yes. for the, yes. of the crow. Dog he's got the crow ones. So he's got a full set of fancy stuff. That's fine. Mm -hmm. cool. Here come the evades. Uh, blank and one, one evade. Let's evade. Spend that. Another one. Two shields. Yep. Two shields mm, gone. That's fine. You were right in guessing that he would do evades instead of focus as yeah. one close up. And it, and it was the correct fire move. Fire control. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Absolutely. fire control. Absolutely. It's it's the only way to fly against Hot Shot Cobra. <clears> yep. Yes. Um... Now, the ghost isn't actually in a terrible position maneuver-wise. It could do one forward, but then it's getting pincered. So the best move for um, for Sean would be to bump both of them yeah. into the ghost. That would be so amazing, because Predator gives you rerolls, Dengar gives you rerolls, and you can even put yeah. like pop the gl glitter steams and like kill Fen Rao. The sick turret. Not turret. any shots. Reroll, I think it's a hit and a crit, and a reroll in from another, another one. That that's focus? the sink turret. I think that's the sink turret. Ah, he's yeah. rerolling that. That was a focus. So that's... Uh, it's another spending of the focus, so three more hits onto Ketsu. But now he hasn't got anything on Ray. Evade, mm. evade. I think nice. that could have cost him. I mean, it's removed the last shield, yeah. but I think now being without any tokens, that's mm -hmm. going to cost him for the future. Yeah. I think Sean tearing in quickly was... Mm -hmm. We questioned it, but I think that's probably the right thing, because he has stripped tokens completely... Nothing's banked on Ray, and now this and only is, three damage to show for Yeah, it. so is Asash on is Asash on trajectory to hit the rock, or uh, it's always difficult to tell from here. Yeah, um, she might be fine with like three straight and just like force the ghost to bump you. Owen spent three tokens and did three damage. That's it. Cost him a token <laughs> yeah. per damage. It's quite expensive. Yeah, yeah. very quite expensive, expensive attack. I mean, yes, it was thanks to stripping down and such, <laughs> but yeah, I think that rock's in the way. I think it's in the way as well. And also, you want to block 5k, right? So, mm. one bank right with Kets, with Asash? Yeah, that would certainly block it. And, like, something straight with... Or even one... Well, bank. obviously, at the minute, Caden moves first. Yeah, so Caden... So, that's a good point. Caden moves first. Caden's not doing a 5k. No. Oh, yeah, right. Because that would get caught. Really, Caden, if he wants to keep get keep his action, it's really going to be a one forward. Yeah. I mean, he could do a two forward and maybe boost. Could you do... Three two, forward boost? Could you do two hearts with Caden here? Uh... Yeah. Like, oh, red, aren't they? No, two is, two is white. One two is, is white. One, yeah. red. One, one and three is red. So two should fit in here, and you are minimizing your chances of them bumping into you. Definitely a Sarge. You are risking an asteroid on either side, though, for you to do that. That is correct, but <laughs> still, I mean... Very true from PJ. Um, <coughs> two turn two away, turn away with the Sarge. Inside arc. Because he has a point. Yeah, but do, but do, you, do, you, do you mean turn, turn a tool to the left? Or to the left, right? Of course. Yeah. Obviously. Yeah. Okay. Dumpy says three forward evade, block okay. one, take evade. Mm -hmm. But yeah. then everyone is shooting at Fen Rao, and he will be in range to for the title, and he Although might get his agility. Think, <laughs> yeah, if there's a bump, he won't get to move the turret for Ketsu. That's Ketsu. He might not have to. He yeah. might not have to. Well, Ketsu's facing forward, so unless Fen Rao... Is there no yeah. gyroscope on neither of them? Oh, nope. They have, he's got yeah, countermeasures because he thought he was going to come up across yeah. harpoons. Because oh, Owen, why would he do so? Why would he do so? <laughs> <laughs> because Owen, Owen's been playing around with harpoons quite a lot recently, was, so indeed. I'm quite surprised that he has picked this list up. Yeah, you thought he was going to fly an Imperial list tonight, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, I did. I did. I mean, I've just played a game with two large ships, and both of them have... Had countermeasures as well. Yeah, there you go. Just because mm. it's a meta meta call, right? Yeah. So you have to uh, three um, forward. What's that? Four, four straight. The four, four straight. Oh. Is he open for a boost bank? That's not going to get through. No. Ooh, he not might. Yet. Depends how they're going to. He might think Fen Rao could boost him out. Yep. Oh, of course, coordinate. Yep. Don't coordinate. Just forget yeah. about boost coordinate. Because it's not, yeah. You don't have to think about it. No. It has meant that. So Sarge... if Ventress is doing straight maneuver, then That's bank a... left with ghost. I mean, boost right. bank left yeah. might. Just I think enough clearance. Ketsu is going to be the difference maker because if Ketsu yep. uh, banks and so catches true. Fen in the side arc, yep. Fen's got to make a choice. Does he defend himself up, barrel away, or 
boost the ghost. I will dare to say, ghost can boost left from here. Ooh, Ooh, close. Oh, I, don't know. I don't know about that. It's Depends what happens maybe. Maybe. Oh, oh. Right. surprise maneuver there. Is it there. the 5k? I think, I think it's it a 5k. Is. 5k. Which wow. will catch Fen. Nice. Yes. <laughs> Unless Fen's doing a, a, a two for, a one forward, Fen's getting caught. And ideally, Fen wants to be able to coordinate uh, the ghost. Will he be caught in New York? If he does a one four, he should be fine. The rest of them, nah, he's gonna get caught. <laughs> and if he's gonna get caught in the front arc and mobile arc and in range one, he is super dead. This yeah. Time. Okay. Oh, wait. Yep. Oh, my there is a. Man. Is this range one? He can't. Is this range one? That's range one. He can coordinate. He can coordinate, oh, but does he want to? He can borrow the left, yeah. and that would be but like then, a safe play. It, I mean, he might die anyway. Yeah. yeah. He he's might die definitely anyway. Definitely going over that. It, he's. Got to barrel roll away, or he's going to be tracked beamed onto that rock. Yeah. Or into range one from Ventress with yeah. zero agility. Yeah. I would put him on the rock, though. That's probably a better call. Mm. To, like, remove his action from next turn. Yeah. Of course. You know. It's the, it's the right call to make. Nice. That was a nice maneuver from... By barrel roll... Yeah. By barrel roll... And he, does, can, yeah. he, can, he can glitter stim this turn if he yep. wants. Yep. It will give him a second stress. But he can just he could kill Fenrir. Yeah, he can just glitter steam with a sash and yep. with, with and that's the great thing because although Owen could barrel roll Fenrir in to get rear arc shot on Ketsu, you mm. got to think <laughs> glitter steam. It would keep him also. It would also keep him out of the way of the asteroid. But yeah, it it would also mean that Sean's like right. I'm going to pop glitter steam now because unless he's not thought, then it might not be affected by it. I think Sean's in a very valuable I mean, position here. It needs to be the Fenrir action first before yeah. any glitter steams, obviously. Uh, Chopper is indeed the droid version. I no, believe. he put R2 and oh, Chopper yes. crew. So the crew. Yeah, So he can start discarding his cards to get shields back. Oh, but no, the Chopper's on the Phantom now. Right, okay. I imagine that's probably... So it's the crew. So it's the crew version. Yeah. Yeah. So he can take his actions when he's stressed. So yeah, so he can take actions when stressed, which... Mm, yes, you, you throw it in oh. for zero points. He's he getting far away gamble. himself to the left. Okay. okay. He, he will go on that rock on his own terms. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, he doesn't want to be I mean, he, getting shot. He was in a terrible position. Like, he yeah, was in a very old position. Like, the so maneuver was, was just was super unlucky to, yeah. to get just in there. Do you lose Fen or do you risk more damage on the ghost? Yeah. I think yeah. that was a better call because. I agree. Is he in range 2? He's probably not even in range 2. If he's in range 2, they're going to push him forward. <laughs> yeah. I mean, he's risking it, but mm -hmm. it was either, yeah. I mean, if he does go forward, it means that he's definitely clearing it next round. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a glitter stim. Something. A glitter stim and, and countermeasures. I believe. On Ketsu. Yeah. That was on Ketsu. Is he popping countermeasures? Oh. I don't think so. He's target locked, right? So, I, like, there's no reason not to mm -hmm. use it. Like, the earlier you use it, the better, really? Yeah. He's not getting shot. He's popping. He's getting shot. The, Look, the glitter stem. He's doing this on Ketsu, not on. He's taking so the stress. Okay. stress, and he should also remove the target lock now. I don't think he's countermeasured. I think or he pointed to not. it by accident. Or maybe, yeah, yeah, maybe. We will see. He we'll was just removing the target lock. All right. I would use it straight away because so Ketsu the stress yep. from Asage. Mm -hmm. Even though they bumped, still in the forward firing arc. Yep. Well, the, the mobile arc. Mm -hmm. All right, Fenrau is going for a shot. He's checking for Fenrau's uh, for range for the ability. I think. Yeah, but he hasn't got any tokens, so yep. I think it's, it's just a shot. shot. Yep. Yeah, might as well take it. Uh, one hit should be fine. Yeah, easy. Yeah, there's paint everywhere. Easily evaded. Mm -hmm. Although we have seen shots like that kill shots. Indeed, we have. <laughs> Fun enough, I've seen it kill Fenrau. <laughs> yes. So, there we go. <coughs> it's not over to the now. Tower. So who do you, who do you, who do you shoot at here? For sure, do you shoot oh, a ghost? I would shoot Fen. I would shoot. Yeah, Fen. Yeah. Is he in range for the tractor beam? I would check range first. If he yeah. is in range for tractor beam, then I would shoot, shoot him, him, pull him, or not, not pull, and then pull him in for the shot from Katsu. Or maybe not uh, from Asash. Oh. Or maybe not because you want him be to be there. I think he's shooting at Kanan. Shooting at Kanan. He's just... We'll see, we'll see uh, hit, he's, hit. He's just... No, he's shooting at Fen because two green dice. Okay. So that's range two shot at Fen yeah. Rao. He will take one point of damage and he will get tractor beam. And I would not move him. I would just leave him there and just like be happy that Asash will have a agility one shot at him. 
has to fend down a shield. Because yeah. if you move him anywhere... He's checking for that. I think I think he's going to he's going to tractor beam him. But there is no no advantage of mm. tractor beaming. He Shadowcaster, right he's indicated yeah. Shadowcaster. Mm -hmm. Will he do it? He's thinking about it. Don't do it! Don't do it! Yeah. You put don't him do it, Sean. The don't rock. do it, Sean. Yeah. You could, but why? You're just gonna give him action next turn. Yeah. It does, however, risk another damage on him. I can but see he, that, but I do agree. Defense. He's already he shot. Will, he He's take, already shot. He will take this damage roll anyway. Yeah, turn. that's true. So it's that's very true, actually. Yeah, you've gained nothing. That's a crit. Oh, actually, that could. Mm. That's oh. a crit. Oh, that could change things. Uh, Structural damage. Structural damage. Ooh, wow. Zero oh. agility now. Dead next turn. <laughs> maybe, or maybe it is. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe. I don't think. No, he's out of. Don't know. He's in there. Uh, she's got arc to the right. Yeah, she can see him, and it does range too. It is range two. So that was the advantage. There we go. Then there you go. Uh, hit, hit, hit. Fen wow. could be dead here. If no Fen... dice. No dice. It's tractor beamed and structural damage. There should be no green dice. I'll go and go. I think he's dead anyway. Isn't he? He's dead. Yep. Yeah. He should he's be dead. dead. No. He's he dead, will take it? one more. Yeah, so yeah. he's dead. Yeah. Uh, oh no. He's... No, no. He took two. He took two. He, oh, they did, two. They didn't figure it out. Right. Yeah. Good spot. So I will try to do this. Ah, now. is structural damage next turn? No. no is it uh, next turn? My major hull bridge starts working ah, okay. next turn. Uh, it's going to be L ship uh, number one. So Fenral, very similar to. Ah, oh, they figured it out. Very similar to Omega Leader in its ability, but also very similar in the fact that it is quite a squishy ship. The gambit paid off for Sean in the end. Yeah. I just removed his hull successfully. I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so proud of myself. Oh. oh. And oh. Now this is where the Nicely place. played. So. Oh, so hang on. Why is he rolling? <coughs> five. Five. Because it's range one rear arc shot from Ghost. Oh, because he's got the. Yeah. Yep. Sorry. I'm, and used five to, hits. I'm used to not putting and shells five in my hits. Ghost. Five hits. F uh, focus. That's and that's very. <coughs> That's Glitter Steam? Glitter Steam. Glitter Steam. Four. Four. Four hits. Ouch. Oh, it does pack a punch, that goes. Ouch. So that's four hell of Ketsu Onyo, which is our one hell. Now. Ouch. And that's Sync Turret now. Yeah. So this. that might be another two. Fen, fen, for, fen for Ketsu. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, fen for Ketsu. Is that yeah. Sorry, what was that? I Fen will. for Ketsu. Right? There we go. Three. Wow. If, if Ketsu blanks out... If, uh, he's got Glitz him. He should be... Ah, uh, he's there. good. Nice. So, Glitter Steam again. So one more. There's at least one damage in there. But... So, ow. Ouch. Ow. What that. would you do with Ketsu to bump? Like, you need to bump now, right? You need you to bump. Dis you disengage. Or you will die. Or you just chase him. Pump a good shot and then die and just accept. Yeah, the fact. because Ketsu does at least get one good attack. You might as well make them make the most of it. I think. Do it on your terms rather than let your opponent catch you off guard. So that was very expensive, healing Fen. Uh, yeah, Terry, you missed <laughs> Fen being blown up. <laughs> yeah. What? Yeah, there was in a another turn. Turn. in a yeah. single turn. In a single but turn. But that is what that, that that's what we said a turn ago. If Ketsu has a shot on him and can pull him, tractor beam him, yeah. he can die in a single turn. Yeah. From just those two shots. Alright, so Dars are down. Oh, he knows what exactly he's doing. He was very unlucky with the yeah. um, crit that he got. Yep. With a tractor beam token as well. That's. Yep. It's not going to end well. Although, you know, so. both of those shots were fully modified because yep. they both popped glitter steams. Mm, I don't think. Or no, no. Ke no. Asash didn't. So, yeah. so Asash don't. had one dice reroll. Yeah. Ketsu had full mods. It's worth mentioning that Asash still has a set of glitter steams that she can pop. Yeah. He's carrying two sets. And is untouched. Yeah, so and she's untouched. Asajj will have two sets of Glitter Stims, actually, not just one. That's true, because she didn't yeah. pop any. Yeah, you're correct. Yeah. So she, she's got two modified attack rounds, which that, at close range, is probably enough to do significant damage mm -hmm. to the Ghost. If he mm -hmm. can, like, remove all shields next turn from the Ghost, and maybe put one or two Hull Points, then Asajj can solo him. Mm. Yeah. Asajj can pretty much exchange Hull for, like, one for one with Ghost, or maybe even... Maybe even dealing more than taking, yeah. so it and, might be enough. Yeah, and the ray bank is empty. Yep. There is yep. nothing in there, yep. so he's going to be recon specking. He's mm -hmm. probably going to use mm -hmm. both of those to bring the 
attack value down. So two bunks for one bunks are green on the ghost? One bunks. Green. One bunks. Two. Yeah. Two on the I think, actually, I think... Two hmm. bunks, I think, might be. Good question. Let's find out. The ghost. Uh, two banks. Two banks, okay. Mm, two so bank banks left is fine. Two bank right. I want two bank right. Two bank left. Yeah. Must, that must be two bank left. <laughs> <laughs> that's the only one. That's that's only, yeah. Bank. Two bank forward. Which I don't think we'd play. Well, no, 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 no. Too, yeah. too straight. Too straight wouldn't be. Wouldn't be enough. So go unless we'll unless he just left. sits where he is. Mm, but then he, and but take then, a double bump. But then, oh no, he's yeah. making a move. Yeah, I think. But then you are look. Ketsu is double stressed, and you need to use that fact. Yeah. Because next turn she will have an evade token. That's a good point. He's yeah. shut down. So you need to now. kill Ketsu straight away because she will not have an evade, and that's just gonna make it easier. I imagine. I think Ketsu's gonna do a two turn, or even uh, try and get out of the engagement zone. So it seems like Sync Turret is paying better than than the TLT against those two ships that have high mobility and can get close to you really quickly. Yeah. Because look at this, this, this turn, if Kanan would have TLT, he wouldn't be able to use his, sink, his turret at all, because he was in range yep. 1. Yep. And this way he put like, what, two, two additional yep. points of damage? Yeah. What What if he plays defensively and disengages with Ketsu, hard twos in with Asajj? You, you can't really disengage with Ketsu here. Like, you're not gonna get out of arc, I think. Even three yeah, the rear arc, arc to the you, left you, will still... Yeah. Make you being caught with it. Okay, that is actually smart. So the best position for for Asash is on range three from the ghost. Yeah. So Sync Turret will never proc. Hmm. You have Predator. If he just if he slow rolls a if he slow rolls a Ketsu, he's out of range. Yeah, I think he is. Mm -hmm. Oh, but he does I'm, have the primary. I'm pretty sure he's just yeah. doing three banks right here yeah. with Ketsu. To either bump or be on range one and just bump as much yeah. damage as you can. Yeah. He's doing three bank, yeah, I think so. Marking up. That's a nice, nice brutal, aggressive game. Mm -hmm. I like it. I don't think it's gonna bump. <laughs> no, 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 it's not. But it's range one, so yeah. I guess it's the best way to use her before she will die. There you go, one big swi uh, attack swing and, before and also, she dies. And also he probably should have used countermeasures last turn. He, he might. So that wouldn't it. stop the sink turret yeah. because the first arc. But both of those shots will have extra agility dice. Mm. And he was glitter steaming, so potentially one additional evade every shot. We'll soon see how things go. So let's switch this around because one, they have one switched. Here. I'm not sure why he evaded with, with Asash here. I wouldn't evade here. I would just go for. He's evading with both, it seems. Um, he's stressed. He cannot do evade with Ketsu. Yeah, because he's stressed. Then... Why oh, isn't he yeah. Glitter Steam. Okay. At mm. what point, if you're Owen, are you thinking about Zeb just to get two ships on the board, or would you wait to kill Ketsu before I would probably ship? wait, unless I would realize that I'm not using these extra shots because of Asajj mobility. Yeah. And if you know you're not getting your extra shot and just like deploy him straight away and use him for I don't know flanking maneuver or something yeah and also glitter steam at this stage seems almost like a waste mm -hmm. because you want to use glitter steam ideally on the turn when you are shooting and they are shooting you yeah and the ghost is only gonna shoot Ketsu obviously this turn right yeah you want to keep a charge as strong as possible for the one on one yep. the inevitable one on one with the ghost that's mm -hmm. going to happen yep and as they're playing Asajj, the wrong Unless way. Ghost is going to be able to just kill Ketsu with the first yeah. shot, which is still possible. Okay, so Ooh. Ketsu, four dice. Is he going to spend his focus token? Yes, so yeah. that's just three. Well, I'll reduce he some damage. He hasn't mm -hmm. popped glit um, countermeasures. He did not pop glitter countermeasures. Oh, Sean. If Two you're watch If you're watching this now, Sean, use glitter steam earlier. Countermeasures mean. Countermeasures, counter sorry, countermeasures, yeah. yes, yes, countermeasures. <coughs> sorry, Predator. Nah, nah, two, not two, happening. Two. Okay, that's not, that's not terrible. It's half what he wants to do, though, which is the ideal role for mm -hmm. him. Is Asajj... Higher PS, yes, she will shoot. So Asajj will shoot now. What is this? What's the dog? And Tractor, Tractor, Tractor token. Okay, <laughs> it's not going well, to happen. Well, if it's range Do three... No, no, then... it's, it's range dice, it's not agility. It's not affected yeah, by Tractor Beam. you always get... Uh, okay, you always, you always like that minus that two yeah. agility, you would still be rolling one green dice for range. Yeah. Not sure if they are 
aware of that. We'll see. I mean, do it if you have it, because then at least you remember your triggers. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Good habit. So, a source of interest shooting. And that's... Hit, hit, it focus. Is. Yep, Peter Steam. Full spread. That will remove the remains of the shields off the ghost. There mm -hmm. we go. We're down to Hull on the ghost. Now the question is, can the ghost remove Ketsu from the board, or will she be able to slink away with this one? I think it's a pretty much guaranteed death at this point. Um, but you never know. Well, well he's got synced yeah. turret as well, hasn't he? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Spend a lot, you want, make you want sure to use this. You want to shoot those things. Spend a lot. Into Get it make back sure. with fire control. That's spend focus. Done. Five. Yeah. There's no avoiding that. That's it. That's, That's it. it. Dead. <laughs> Overkill. Even. Okay, that was expected. But she did her job. She put. Oh, he did pop counter it. Oh, he did. Oh, he did. Pop counter measure. So why did he use? Did he reroll? He did do a reroll. Ah. Or maybe he just flipped them with, um, with focus token. Did he roll five paint on all five dice? Well, regardless, this thing is now dead. Because look at all that damage that's being dealt out. Okay, that's way more than he needs anyway. So. Yeah. Oh, Ketsu. He's, yeah. He's rolled four folk at three eyeballs. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's when he really wanted to glist him. Yeah. Pop. Pop. There goes Pop the Ketsu. Goes. So mathematically well, speaking, Asash can solo uh, Ghost with Ten Hal. Yeah. Because she's got Ten Hal. She's got more agility. Uh, the double shot. The double shot might not be so important if Asash is able to stay in long range. Yeah. If she will be close, she will be able to use her ability. So either or, um, so yeah, she's not in a terrible spot now. All right, so it comes down. I mean, this might go both ways. Yeah, yeah it comes down to Assange versus Kanan mm -hmm. with yes. Zeb in reserve. Although I'm not, th I don't think Zeb is going to factor into this game much. No, probably not. He's there just to get the extra attack, and that's it. Have mm -hmm. we seen this extra attack, or not yet? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Just now. I think. So when. The first engagement, I think. Yeah. We saw it. So we chucked four dice. Then he did the sink turret at the end, which is what stripped Ketsu down to... Absolutely painful. Yeah. Okay. All right, then. So, Ketsu's... I mean, Asajj is, is a good spot. She has her turret in the right direction where she wants to go. Mm -hmm. And she can keep on stressing the ghost. And that's going to mess up the ghost's turning capabilities somewhat. However... Owen Both really wants to roll and bank yeah. up first. Well, I would have done two forward. Uh, That's probably enough, and he wants to go as slow as possible to yeah. bank up as many focus tokens as possible with Ray. It was more getting distance and then going around the asteroid that I was thinking about. So, but but it's Lancer, so she's gonna so Asaj is gonna do three bank to the right or two straight, and that's out of range anyway. Yeah, I take well, Get I think it's in range now, but he's taking a target lock for the future. Yeah, but she will move. And she's stressed, and remember no no speed one maneuver is green on, on Lancer Dial. Is he doing a hard turn or is he gonna do a three bank? bank? That's three bank. Yeah, three bank. Definitely been flying this. This is the harder. <laughs> this is the harder matchup for the ghost because of that expert handling. Yeah. And yeah. Be, but, but because he has it, sure. Uh, expert. But that was on. That was on Ketsu. Oh, I was on, on Ketsu. Ketsu. Okay. Yeah. In case, in that case, so this is a your yeah, typical no, okay. tanky Asajj build. Yeah. Fair enough. Tanky Asajj versus uh, Kane. Well, Sargis. the tanky has PTL, not Predator. Yeah. So that's like the <laughs> that's like Christopher Patek's special. Yeah. Uh, Ventress with Predator, not with uh, PTL. Uh, Blando mentions uh, two three turns now. Build Ray. Yeah. Uh, yes. Yes. Yeah. 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 That's it. That's it. Build up yeah, that rate. He has to. He has to turn in now. So Asajj is doing three hard to the right, and Ghost is doing two hard to the left. Yeah, I wouldn't risk a one forward than a turn. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Maybe you want to stress yourself, but then you're not really helping things. All right. If you got, uh, if you have multiple unspent tokens, can you put multiple of them on Ray, or is it just one? Just one. Just one. Just one. You can bank up one, and you can unbank one as well. Fair enough. One bank. Yeah. Okay. S slowing. Keep it slow. It also allows them to see where Sarge is going. Whether she's going wide or if she's doing going tight. That much. Like she, she should try to re-engage as quickly as possible. Yeah. Yeah. Not to Ray. I agree. Not to Ray. Yeah. So she's doing hard. exactly that. Yeah. And she will flip her Move your to, the, yeah. Yeah, to the other side. Or maybe even... No, not mm. straight. To the left. Well, he's not doing it to now. Left. He's thinking so what he wants to do. So if he will flip it to the left, then he can go down between those two rocks and yeah. then turn left and just keep chasing the uh, the ghost? Yeah. Well, 
we'll soon see. He's not sure if he's in range. Yeah. He's probably thinking about taking focus instead. There's the focus. Okay. Austin of eight, actually. Mm. Uh, out. Yeah. That's a shame. So, Sync turrets one to two, so yes. why is he... He definitely wasn't in range two there. Hmm. That's a good point. He wasn't thinking about range. No. Hmm. Well, it's a turn wasted where he could have turned his turret, and that could cost mm -hmm. him an action further down the line. Yeah, yeah. it will Quality. definitely, yeah. So, there we go. And he's used one Glitter Stim already, hasn't he? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. Which means he's got one left. One just sitting there, ready to go. The problem is the ghost will be running away now. He's going to do, like, bunk as quickly. He should bunk as quickly as possible to the left. Yeah. Do you think he'll do a... Three a to the left? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. You think he's gonna go face to face? Maybe. I mean, it's not great because then you'll have because this rock he... in like in front of you. But you, you, do you care flying over a rock if you're a ghost? Yeah. Next turn. Maybe not. Maybe not. He'll then have him in his rear arc. I clearly, haven't been flying enough of them. I, didn't <laughs> <think about> that. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Turn. Bring the uh, power weapon up. So you're saying too hard to the left, basically, with the ghost to just yeah. like point your arc. If he's if he's gonna be aggressive, a two. Just be aggressive. Yeah. But he's gone for the bank. He's gone the for, bank. The, he's gone for yeah. the safe maneuver. Who, uh, so if she is going straight, or if she is banking to the right, then she will arc dodge him. She will arc dodge him. I think. But then she will waste her action to rotate the yeah. arc. Which is fine. Predator will still kick in. Yeah. And then... He's doing oh, a he's boost boosting. bank. Nice. I wanted to boost. Nice. I guess it's around Ooh. further. Oh, when it catches the arc, Ooh. if Asajj... Yeah. Is going slow. Mm. She might be going slow. She might I, be doing one. I think. I, think. Um, yeah, I think she's going to do like a too hard to the right. Or um, two banks to the right. Yeah. Five K with massage now. If he's doing a five K, <laughs> he's got great foresight, and I want to know what lorry numbers are for next week. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> no. No. He's doing no. No. <laughs> no. And look, he doesn't have to rotate. Yeah. He's arc now. No. He is doing five K. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I want another lottery numbers for next week, Sean. Awesome, Sean. Awesome. <laughs> bold. Very bold. Very bold. I didn't see this coming, no. unless, like, the very last moment. <laughs> I mean, that could have been a bump so easy. Yeah. yeah. If, the, if the ghost had not uh, banked boost... You and also, know. is she arc to... Did she actually arc dodge him? Yeah, I think so, yeah. She Maybe the have. rear. We will see. We'll we will see out. in just a moment to see if he's attacking. There's probably. a glitter steam proc. So, glitter steam, double stress... Mm. Mm. Not Rare. sure if that's the best moment, but... He's applying the ray, I think, because he realises yep. I kind well, of need the shield to shield down. <laughs> the shields are gone, so... So that's going to be stress from Ventress, focus removed to remove the dice, Yeah. and then three dice fully modded against the ghost. Blank, oh, blank hit. One reroll from Predator, mm. just one. That is unlucky. Why oh, oh, re-roll it. Re it. He's forgotten the Predator. Oh, missed opportunity, Sean. How can you re forget your EPT? Don't do it ever again. <laughs> was a valuable slot in the game. And now the sync turret, <laughs> yeah. so he'd arc dodge him successfully. Yeah, so it is the sync turret. But it's still a three dice attack. Target locked, and there will be. Oh, there will be a reroll for me. Hit, focus, and a blank. Mm -hmm. Well, FCS, so surely you reroll those two that are not yeah, hits, right? Yeah, I would do the exact same. Yes, just reroll it. Oh, why? 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 I think he just wanted to be fair, and he yeah. decided not to use them as well. Maybe. There's an evade. And that's no yeah. damage. No yeah. damage at all. <laughs> oh, the second attack. Second sync turret attack. Oh, second yeah. sync turret. So even if he argues him, there are just sync yeah. turrets to, to use. Okay, fine. One damage. That's one damage. That's one damage through. Split Razzy. <laughs> yeah, good point. Last Razzy. Yeah. She's on the correct ship, actually. For this type of build, <laughs> it's the correct ship. There you go. <laughs> Lutz Razi. Oh, so no damage after all. No damage. No damage Lutz at all. Lutz Razi. Okay, and this is fine. So now is this going to be like an old nautical warfare where they've just parked Bro the yeah, yeah, broadside <laughs> for the next four turns? Although, you know, the, like the, the best broadside for, for the ghost is not actually sides. It's, mm. it's front and back. Yeah. So it depends how they're gonna how they're going to do it. Okay, so at this point, the, sh the stress has been cleared, so you could do it too right with a with a ghost shot at your Iraq, especially if Sarge's going to uh, 
chase you because she has she has to go forward. Yeah. So Asajj will have to do two strides to clear one of the stresses at least. Yeah. With two stress, you can I I, I guess you can force a bump. Yeah. I guess. After doing yeah. hard two to the left, bank up ray. Okay, Asajj will clear clear one stress, but then you are pointing in the other direction, like in, in different directions. So yeah. you are flying away from each other, which is better for the ghost, I guess. Hmm. I can see it. Mm. I just think that two hour turn, shoot out of the rear with the ghost, and then turn around the asteroid because it would it would set you up perfect for the next following rounds. I one think. Ba one bank right with the ghost. One bank. Mm -hmm. uh, if Sean if Sean's yeah. expecting a bump, he might go one forward, two straight at least. Two, one is not the green. Two, yeah. so two straight is like the minimum. Two straight will be in arc of his rear if he goes one right. He's going. It's got one bump. bank left. Yeah. I guess it stops an attack, but it also means you're not getting an attack on. Ooh, too straight. Right. 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 Yeah. Oh, if too if too straight, if that's too straight, then it too straight might will be might a not. bump, or it might be. I think it's not right going to be a bump. bump. It's not going to be a bump, but well, it might be an arc, and you well, have to avoid that arc. There's the recon specialist giving two focus tokens. We shall see. Okay, Sean, what have you gone? Two forward. <sighs> this is this is oh, oh, oh. Be in the arc. It's going to be very close. I think. You're right, Voitek. Yeah, it's in. It's in the arc. It's not a bump. Oh. oh. Okay, so this is going to hurt. Especially that she's double stressed. Now once stressed, so she will not have her action. No, and she's out of blitz. Where's, Where's the bump? I think it's a bump. It's a bump. It is a bump. Oh. oh. Well, that's actually better that's for her. better for us. Much yes. better. Okay. And if it wasn't such an awkward angle for Owen, maybe even the 5k would have blocked out next turn. Yeah. But I don't think that's going to happen. Mm -hmm. Not with that asteroid where it is. Um, hmm. So with this kind of fight, I wouldn't be popping Z or uh, Z. No, no, no. Yet. You don't want to get the stress on there. Yeah. You're um, getting a lot, of shot, a lot of extra shots, so... Here we going forward. Three you don't forward want to... with the ghost this turn. If you catch your arc, then brilliant. If you're not, then you got your sync turret. That's what it's there for. Of course, but stressed. Imagine, so he'll be going five, two forward. 5k now, of course. Ready? He can't. He's just dropped the stress. Oh, right. She the... just got the stress from four. Yeah. Yeah. So now he has to clear so that stress. Three bank to the right. Uh, two or... bank is the only green oh, move they can do. Um, but that also leaves it very easy for Asajj to just bump again and clear yeah. that stress. Mm -hmm. Oh, we had a great opening. Last great phase against evade US Reigns. <coughs> and we're coming up to just short of. Uh, 15 minutes left. I mean, we've got 25 minutes left on the clock right now. I don't think it's going to go to time, but you never know. With uh, Asajj untouched, eh, the ghost can go die very quickly once you point guns in its direction. So at the minute, if it was tournament rules, obviously, the ghost is winning. Owen's winning. Yeah. By one hull or two hull. So if he would lose half points on Kane and Jerus, who is worth about 55, that would be 27... Plus what? And Fenrau is eighteen, and that's fifty three. So twenty six plus eighteen. Um, Sean would be winning if he can yeah. half point. Okay, uh, there's another rex spec use. Getting some because forty nine. I think she's worth forty nine. Is he? Bumping. Yeah, bumping. Yeah, bumping I, th again. that's the best choice he can yeah. do. It means he clears the stress. No attacks. Mm -hmm. It has given Owen another couple of rounds with mm -hmm. uh, getting those focus tokens on Ray, mm -hmm. though. So there's another token on Ray to join the, the brother. There's two on Ray mm -hmm. for a total of possibly three tokens next round. This makes Four, three. Yeah, three. Yes. This makes so the sorry. next attack. It'd be great if you could take all of them Quite off Ray and just pop them on, yeah. but no. So she is not stressed now. Uh, Kanan is not stressed, mm. I think. He might be out of arc. So would you go three back to the left mm. to force her? Yeah, I mean, she can I... go straight. He can go left. He can go right. A lot of choices, and like left is the best one because oh if Asajj does the space. not call it. Yeah, I just I think I sussed it again. It's gonna be a three. It's gonna be a three bank from Owen, or a two bank from Owen, and another five k from Sean. <laughs> no, look Surely not does. now. No. Look, he does look love his five k. Look yeah, where the turret is. Those. Look where the turret again, is. Yeah, that again, is true. Yeah. The arc would be <laughs> facing the correct. He's not moved the turret all game. Yeah, I mean, yeah. he's made interesting <laughs> use of the full five k in like a way of chasing the ghost and keeping his arc on, and it would stress the ghost, making it harder to get the wreck spec. Yeah. Mm -hmm. well, there's the two yeah. dank. 
Make use of the space, make use of the rear arc. No, there's three. There's three, you're correct. Yeah, I think that's, like, tactically speaking, for next few turns, this is the best call. Because he'll have all the focuses now. Yeah. And I think, yeah, have to I think, you're right. I think he may be 5k. <laughs> I mean, I'm surprised this is myself. This is a very but, uh, interesting way. Instead of rotating your arc, just, just rotate your ship. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, it works. <laughs> works so far, yeah. Right, so recon spec. Mm -hmm. So that's another two tokens, which uh, Ray will get in the end. Probably should Though that's, like, safely speaking, that could have been just one strike. Oh, oh, no, no, one, round. Done. <laughs> one round. Nicely done. One round. Nicely done. Would you rotate this your arm? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you should pass him. I would do the same. He's not going to do it. He's I mean, rotate. even even if like you could just do evade instead, mm. the arc is going to stay. Uh, yeah. The, yep. Yeah. Perfect. There we go. Great. Second glitter steam or no glitter steams? No glitter steams left. No glitter He's all out. He oh is, yeah, he used the second one after the K turn. He is hyped out of glitter steam at this point. Now, this turn, Asa is going to take more damage than she will be able to deal because no actions. Yeah. So stress and Ventress shooting oh, first. So we're going to have... Minus one. Please remember your predator now, Sean. Please remember your predator. <laughs> Ding. A uh, hit, hit, focus. Yes, Predator. Predator. We're rolling Definitely, that focus yeah. into, well, hopefully hit. As, into a blank. Mm. Well, it's still two that's hits on the ghost. Two. So that's half points, I think. Five, that six, seven, eight. That is officially yep. now half points on the ghost. So if he can keep his Asajj Ventress alive on the tournament, that would be... This is... Well, we shall see, so what will happen. Well, eight, this is eight... Eight Ooh, dice coming in his way. A lot of blanks. Spend, no, he will spend the target. Spend the target lock. Fire control system means he gets it back. Does yeah. he still still have countermeasures? Uh what? He should have used countermeasures. Though. Yeah. He should have used countermeasures. If there he is has like it, no then, points yeah, to keep have, it. Yeah. Oh. Five hits are there on a side of interest. So just minus one, one of eight. And another one Latrazi. from Latrazi, and that shield's gone on the go on the on the lancer. Okay. Ouch. Now sink to it. And countermeasures would mean one damage point, not three. Yeah. And of course, there is also the turret shot to come in as well, as yep. uh, Steven yep. mentions. Absolutely. Potentially focused. And with rerolls, because you're in arc. Yeah. Exactly. It works on the special arc, right? Right, as well? Yeah. Okay. It's an arc. Still counts. Uh, yeah, there you go. Reroll that one. Sink turret. Or FCS. Doesn't matter. One of those two. There's a focus. By the focus, you've got. Will he? Oh, because he might want to bank I, it. I, I I'll spend it, yeah. yeah. Go for damage, go for the damage. I mean, it's a damage you can definitely shut mm -hmm. through. Uh, I think one that's evade, a... One eyeball? Yeah, it's one evade, one, one, one eyeball. Okay. Cock dice. Yep. So evade again. Evade. Evade. And he is one. not... One damage card. Two, two, two damage, damage cards. cards. So the Three, three. three. okay. Two focus. Ouch. So this the rebels is... are winning again. So he must, de he must kill the ghost now. Yeah, there's no half measures now. He's got to go for the kill. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, Asajj is bleeding more hull than the ghost is. Yeah. And the ghost has... He can afford to yeah. not pop Zeb for at least a round as well, yep. because Asajj yep. can't deal that much damage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, completely agree. In fact, I'd say maybe even two rounds, depending on mm -hmm. how good you use um, your Kanan. So I would slow roll now with interest. Just went back to I the think left. There's a lone A wing on Ray as well, so he's got Focus a little up. bit in the bank. Yeah, mm -hmm. it is definitely swinging. Yes, because into... he hits two last turn, and he was yeah. only able to grab one, one of those. So it is definitely swinging in the rebels' favour. Mm -hmm. Sean's going to be relying on the evade and the lats Razi to get him evades. Yep. And ideally, he wants to try and get out of arc. But that's gonna be difficult because the ghosts. Owen's gonna fly to make sure that there is an arc. Yeah, to be found. If you're Owen, do you go quickly? Do a three. Mm, thing is, it's risky because it's the I know that you know game. Because if you go yeah. fast and Ketsu goes mm -hmm. slow, you have range. You're losing your sync turret. Exactly. Yep. But if you go slow and she bumps. Yep. Yeah. So see how screwed uh, ooh, Ghost would be shit. if he would have TLT at this moment. Yeah. yeah he would very. not ever get this like second TLT shot. And this way, he's like dealing so much damage now. If he turns, then he's caught it good. 5k. 
There it is. Why? I mean, why? I can't believe you called that one. I'm not sure. But why? Why? Like, he loves a 5K. But the ghost could have been going straight. And I think, and you think he might have got out of arm. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Why? why, why this why time it's not paid off for him, I think. Oh, oh, oh yeah, dodge it. Yeah, dodge it. Yeah. That no, is... why, Sean? Why? <laughs> I'm not sure what movie thought he was going to do. Glove one, apparently, but it didn't really work out. I think this might be. Uh, yeah, it must be it. I mean, she <coughs> has four four health left. Yeah, but so two, two attacks. Fully, mo- fully modified. Full yeah. modifications as well. Stress to oh, size. Primary attack with nice. a target lock rerolls as well. Yeah. Yep. No mm. countermeasures again. Yeah. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Hit, hit, hit. That's if she might, that must, that might be it. If she blanks yeah. out, then that is it. Yep. Two. Roll. Blank. Yeah, blank. Yeah. Dead. <laughs> <laughs> Dear me. Is it luck though? Mm. No, I mean, I mean, okay. The, he totally took a risk doing the five, the yeah. first five K turn. Super risky. That, it paid off. Yeah. But I'm not sure like, why it's not, he did that mm. then. <laughs> like that's. Yeah, you're not getting your arc. Yeah, I'm not I mean, sure what move he thought. Like, I mean, there is no I mean, no man move that is countered by this 5k? Yeah. Well, that's not it. We still have one more game to have, which is the Tankard match, which is next. And that is Robin versus Mick. So if you love the Wookiees, Wookiees, stay tuned. There's going to be a few. <laughs> you think going to be running the Wookiees? Because Robin, we know. Oh, you know. He's going to be flying the Wookiees. Not oh, a different Wookiees. Not, yeah, exactly. I was very All surprised. Right. Yeah, the Wathro is the two named Wookiees, uh, Liberator... All with, well, uh, the Liberator's got Commandos and... Is it better against Heavy Alpha Strike? Uh, Better than Classic for Wookiees, for for Kashyyyk Defenders? The thing is, right, one of them is going to die of the Alpha Strike. So you'd rather lose a Kashyyyk Defender for 25 points rather than Lorik for... What would have been on MOV? I think it's half points on the Ghost and Fenrau dead, so... Yeah, so that would be about 50 points advantage. Yeah. Uh, Not 50... 40 so some, 27, 27 30, for Kanan 40, 40 some, 40 some, 42 43 maybe 27 for Kanan 28 for Fenrau uh, 27, so that's 50, killed 55 55, 55 killed, points 45 in uh, Owen's advantage basically yeah 45, 45 difference 45 difference so Owen finished with 45 on OV and Sean no the terrible well, results yeah no. there. but um, yeah Sean forgetting countermeasures Predator <laughs> uh, Owen and, forgetting uh Target lock rerolls as well yeah. once. Yeah. Although that might have been a gentle gentleman's. Yeah, yeah maybe yeah. he realised later. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, I didn't. You didn't spend that, so I won't spend this. Are we inviting yeah. them for the for the chat? If you want to, <laughs> let's bring them back. Is that time? It's always amusing to. to, to, to we got about. Uh, we got about ten, fifteen, 15 minutes. minutes. Yeah, that's enough, right? Get a minute. And I'm gonna start if I can figure it out. So, who's going to be on the left? I have no idea. Let's say Robin is going to be on the left. I think if the Wookiees should probably be on the left, because it's already got the Rebel badge. Very well, then. So, those of you that are watching, um, would you have done anything differently? Let us know what you think. I wouldn't do the second K turn. No. I wouldn't do the first one either, and no. that was a must. <laughs> yeah, it, was. <laughs> it was a great call from yeah. Sean. <laughs> How are you doing, gents? Hello. Not bad. It's just like behind the. Uh... Congrats on the win. Thank you. I've waited to watch the boot cam camera. Yeah. Mm, <laughs> this one. Let's close that down. No, so, it's, a, it's, a good, it's a good game. Yeah. And it's an interesting. I mean, like, I love lances. Yeah. And lances <laughs> are awesome. They're incredibly fun to fly. And I've flown dual lances a lot, which probably helps a little bit because I was. Like just a saying, that, That's fine. Yeah, you know them. Probably better than They're I not the most unpredictable yeah. ships. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. super predictable. Yeah, so you're, you're, doing, you're doing threes. You're doing, doing very odd K-turns. You're doing very odd K-turns. Most of Sean's manoeuvre, except for his K-turns. Yeah. yeah. Super, super unpredictable. Yeah. And when I called the K-turn, you didn't do the K-turn. <laughs> and, and the first K-turn killed, was amazing. killed yeah. Ben. Yeah. Um, and I'm not... Yeah. Oh, sorry. We called... We didn't expect the third one oh, and four. the second one. There, yeah, there were four K- K-turns, wasn't there? 
three, I think. There's a few. One, kills. one with Katsu and then two with Asajj. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So the one with Asajj was great. The second one, which was the first one from Asajj, was great. But the last one from Asajj, we couldn't figure out why you did this last one. When Asajj died? Yes. Yeah. I, I, well, I was just thinking, engaging at range one behind... But there that was, was no... That was going bad, wasn't it? But there was no so, maneuver you could potentially have countered by okay. the skater. No, I was just like he was he was basically going left, okay. and he just like I, I consider the five k myself. Yeah, but then yeah. you would have shot without return anyway. Yeah, I just decided because I wasn't guaranteed to kill him that round, and I'd been burning through my banked focuses pretty quickly. Yeah, um, which you need to because they're fantastic. I thought it was better to just. I mean, I could. I realized I could still have five k the turn after that anyway. Mm -hmm. You can still see yeah. it. Yeah, a, a lot of space. I, I, yeah. was on that table. And he could, and I realised that the way, basically, after he couldn't stress me, well, in a, in an odd way, you shouldn't have spent the stress on me because it would have made me much much more predictable. Yeah, it would have. Helped and I do kind of need my actions for that ship. Um, that does like actions, kind of. It? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, I mean, you're somewhat resistant because you've got Ray, so you've yeah. got at least a focus, and you you maintain the lock, so you normally have a mod there, mm -hmm. battle from the synced turret but it's not yeah you want yes yeah. also yeah. sean did you use your countermeasures yeah i did yes both of them for both of them yeah did you yeah. see it's, it's a gold token it that gold used. gold was the countermeasures and the white yeah, yeah i was i was like paying attention to the target locks you were discarding and i couldn't see you discarding target locks he didn't oh, he didn't, didn't discard did the target locks so you just roll oh. the extra dice. Oh, yeah. Yeah. oh, like you know, the target lock is actually better than this yeah. agility. But it's not only, I mean, to be fair, yes. it wouldn't have made a massive difference. The only thing it would have done is denied me the reroll on my primary shot because I was generally uh, keeping him in arc. Yeah, yeah. For the primary and the synced anyway. But on the turn when we fought, Sean would use target uh, countermeasures, which he probably did, but without discarding target lock. Yeah, you maybe. got like two extra ones with it. Yes, I did. Which is additional turn. Yeah, that is a whole turn. Of being alive. Yeah, yeah. I boo booed there, didn't I? And the same, so did you use the, on Ketsu, did you use the target lock in the turn when you K-turn behind the ghost? Because that that was the turn when we said, okay, countermeasures now. Yeah. And then no, there was used, the target I'd lock. I'd already used it then, hadn't I? At the end, you mean? Um, no, a turn before. So. Oh, when, when she K-turned on the turn when you killed Fenrao. Yeah. I remember now, what did I... Maybe that was it. Lock. Maybe that was it. Lock. I you think didn't drop the lock, yeah. The, the problem Sean had, and uh, I mean, I, I've only played three games with this list, and I filthy net listed it having in charge of <laughs> evil tech, because I thought it would look really fun to fly, because it's the ghost bubble shot without taking a TLT yep. or an accuracy corrector, which I don't feel is filthy doing, because I find that quite boring to play against. It's possibly more filthy. It's possibly more filthy, but it, does, <laughs> but it also does require me to fly to keep people yeah. in arc. I don't yeah. just circle at a great So you're distance. basically trading your range one donut hole into yeah. range three donut hole. But it encourages yeah. fun, dynamic, charge at them type yeah. play, which I like yeah. a lot more. Yeah, it's a good build. It's um, but there, are, you know, you learn things with these lists really quickly. The problem I think you had is that you dropped. I was saying before, on the turn where you K'd Ketsu behind me and killed Fenrao, mm -hmm. you glitter stimmed and countermeasured oh, yeah. on I hit, both. I hit all the countermeasures. You basically, spent loads much. of stuff in once. And the problem with that was I was only ever going to shoot. There was them. no yeah. way I was going to shoot Asajj. Yeah. She was at range 2 or 3. Uh, Ketsi was behind me at range 1. There was no way I was going to shoot Asajj. And yeah. in a, you believe her steamed on this turn. Yeah. Yeah. And I only had one guy to shoot with, so there was no... There, you know, the ones oh, on, yeah, yeah. I mean, if Asajj had yeah. had a countermeasures and a glitter stim later on... Yeah, it would, would have, have been, more, have been more helpful later on, wouldn't it? Well, let's face it, it's difficult to actually time countermeasures and glitter steam so that you don't waste it, but you also don't Overdo keep it, it for Particularly for against a non-ordinance list. <laughs> yeah. so it's easy with an pick, alpha strike. Yeah, you have to pick it at the absolute right time. Yep. Yeah, yeah, it's to, a bit more obvious with yeah. missiles, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. So versus this list, I would wait with my glitter steam until the turn when I am absolutely sure he's going to shoot me twice and I will yeah. shoot him. I think that yeah. uh, your list is really good against the ordnance stuff that's everywhere right now. Yep. And uh, it will well, really since I started it. using it, I haven't met any ordnance. <laughs> yeah. So people who I managed to go a whole tournament on Saturday without flying against one set of harpoon missiles, <laughs> which I think is on which half the half the half the people there had ordnance. I think every gunboat almost except for Robin Swan, yeah. Michael Mads, myself, Christopher Patak. Yeah, they're, they're definitely 20. about, aren't they? Yeah. I flew this against uh, Michael Mags' tournament-winning 
dirty, dirty triple skirt. Did he? Did Cannabis. he alpha strike Ghost of the board straight? No, no, not at all. Like I, it was really close. It, it got down to uh, the ghosts versus one of the skurgs with uh, just its hull left, I think. But I deployed my shuttle. I did everything. <laughs> um, it was it was difficult. I, I could have flown it better. We talked about it afterwards. He was helpful, but that's a filthy, horrible list because it has the <laughs> alpha, but then it keeps and on it causing massive control. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Um, yeah, a decent shit. If that makes yeah. you feel better, Sean, people who are flying twin twin shuttles a lot are saying that the the like old ghost with TLT and Doc Phantom and Bix was the worst matchup for them, which probably makes this list mm. also kind of a counter for yeah. for double answers. Big, big tournament season coming up. Are you both going to stick with this, or are you looking at using something else? Yeah, I'm keen to stick with this. I've just yeah. started flying the Twin Lancers yeah. with a mind to looking at the regionals, and then system open. Then the system open. My first ever system. All open. the cool kids are just doing system open. Uh, <laughs> are uh, you or not? I'm doing system open. I'm not doing. I'm in here for regionals. Right. Okay. Oh, okay. I'll be judging you all. Uh, you are a real yeah, gentleman across the internet to be yeah. to do that yeah and did you because you've been playing around with harpoons and the imperial with stuff. all of the stuff really yeah, this is always what I do because I don't get as many I don't get that many opportunities to play compared to some other people some people play not much either uh, I don't have the kind of ability to play around with loads of things then fly a list 30 times before big tournaments yeah, yeah. Um, I have tried the ordinance things and I, I'm tempted to go that way, but this is quite fun. I mean, I, I, I did clone it, although I changed one thing from the list from the Krakow uh, regional. Which was? Um, uh, she had that... Um, Flight of Stasis Strike instead of R2. Right. And I tried it um, in the first game I played, and then I swapped to R2 because I understand the logic of Flight Assist. It's guaranteeing getting something in arc for Fen. Yeah. But because Fen wants to use his ability to, um, which gives him a stress, I found R2, basically what I found is because you've got the rear arc on, on Fen, it's very unlikely you don't have anyone in your front or rear arc at range yeah. 1 to 3. When you do, great, you get to use it, but I didn't find the way I was flying Fen that happened after the opening move. You have one hard on his dial. Uh, no, I don't think you do. I, I believe it does, does it? Because that would be a massive selling point for, no. for R2 Astromech. No. The real no. Fen round does. The point, is so it it only actually... <laughs> the point is it gives me a green turn, which means I can do a green hard two, uh, which is great if I'm if I'm Kaying the uh, the ghost or just moving the ghost forward to use the rear arc. I can turn Fen off to one side, but yeah. still be shedding a stress. Also, it means if you eye on me and I do my move, I still get to ditch my... He's Fenro, uh, he's Scam. Obviously, you can take R4 Agromech. The <laughs> <laughs> Seems that reasonable, do. doesn't it? Mm. I mean, against this list, in fact, um, Hotshot Copilot and Fenro's ability were functionally useless. Yeah. Uh, they they are we, effectively yeah. used. I mean, no, I, I mean, you are forcing your opponent to take actions other than focusing up. Which for Lancers are great because they can do evade and they have offensive rerolls from and crew he had and Predator PTC. Yeah. And he had yeah. all of the, Dengar, the, yeah. the other stuff. And, and Litter Steams, yeah, which Dengar. don't care about. So, all I could really do is um, strip a non existent focus and stop him using the odd evade he took, which was kind of pointless. Yeah. So, Fen died. But Fen can stop. With, Fen with Hotshot Copilot can stop effectively two missiles every yes. turn, right? Because he yeah. strips focus from a guy with, uh, with Dead Eye, if there yeah. is one, yeah. which is quite mm. like Gumball to Dead Eye. Strip the focus. He just stops it from no, hot shot. Shot. Same as hot shot. Oh, hot hot shot, shot copilot. Yes. And then mean? you can force the other guy to like not spend his target lock on harpoons. He can still use guidance strips. But that and might give you five happens. So it's only really all you're stopping is the reroll. That's Which a is, lot. It's good. That's a lot. No, it's does good. Fen's ability work that way with hot shot copilot though? Because hot shot copilot says you must spend They happen at different times. Okay. That's two so, different things. Yeah, uh, hot shot copilot happens when I shoot. Yeah. Uh, whereas um, it's the activation. Yep. When his in ship, yeah. Yeah, when he, yep. yeah, when his ship becomes the active ship in the combat phase, yeah. that's when they decide. So, hot shot copilot would say, "You must spend it if you're allowed." Yeah. But you just forbid it yeah. just before the shot was was actually performed. So you cannot spend it. So you will not spend it. Yeah. But you use mm. more different ships mm -hmm. if you can. It's a good list. I I will try it some more. Uh, it is. I mean, you can get Alfred pretty badly, but you have some pretty good closing the range options. And if you get the range control right, yeah, you, it's a better ship than most for stopping people from getting range two to three for their harpoons. Yeah. Um, fun. 
it was a good game. And I think two or three times people have mentioned tonight my expert handling. I've got to ditch that, haven't I? Yeah. That's, that's just not. <laughs> I understand why it was on there, and it, you know. It, yeah, I had good intentions when I put it on there, but yeah. Since you've got three glitter stimmers in the lid, sorry, and two counter measures already, yeah, measures, I don't think you need expert handling. I think nope. you'd be better off. There. Uh, how many points is it? Two points. So I can get another glitter. Stim. I mean, that's that's expertise on one of them and adaptability on the other. Or I mean, there are all sorts of things. It's almost know. another predator. Maybe not predator because you. There's also dinger already. Yeah, yeah, yeah like, a lot of options. I'm kind of thinking another glitter stim. Glitter stim and three, three points to score to settle. Yeah. No, three point EPT. Yeah. Two, isn't it? Two. Expert handling is two. Yes, yeah. but that's so you're saving four by dropping it off both ships, right? That's no, only on one. Oh, it's only yeah. on one. I thought it was on both ships. So yeah. I forgot the predator on the other one. It's fun. Or you could even put fearlessness, which on Katsu <laughs> works pretty nicely. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's what it does, doesn't it? Yeah, it really does. <laughs> and you had a lot of range one shots this, this game. Yes. Although, really, Kanan's ability. So, so broken. <laughs> yeah, so I good. was, I was yeah. finding that very frustrating. Every Imagine you were. Time. <laughs> it only really works because it's got zero agility, so you're yeah. reducing the damage, not getting rid of all of it. Otherwise, that would be horribly, horribly, horribly broken. <laughs> yeah. Where's my three it, agility guys? It's please. broken already with Ray and Precon spec. Yeah. Yeah. Because you are having all of this focus on this. <laughs> yeah, we have one more match to do. Yep, so we're going to away, so the other Vacate the premises. Thanks all. Thank you very much. Thank you.